So you sense that Jesus has been knocking on the door of your life? I know I had that call many years ago. It could be that you're feeling like something is missing. Maybe you have been experiencing even great success as the world would define success, yet you find yourself empty. You find yourself still longing for something. You're not sure what that is. My dear friend, we have been designed as human beings to desire and to require and need a relationship with a higher power. That higher power is God. And specifically, we want to talk about Christ Jesus, the second person of the Trinity, who makes it possible for us to have relationship with God. You see, to have this relationship, you must believe. It is by faith, not by works, by faith. What is it that we believe? We believe that God the Father, the first person of the Trinity, sent God the Son, the second person, to live a perfect life here on earth. He died a terrible death on the cross at Calvary, he took upon himself and upon he took upon himself all of my sin, all of your sin, all of these these things that we've done that have offended him. He died, he was buried on the third day he rose again. When we believe this, we receive the guarantee of eternal life. The third person of the Trinity, the Holy Spirit, comes to live within you. And now, my dear friend, with the gifts that he brings, we now can live lives of victory, fulfillment, and more than that, lives that glorify God. As a byproduct, we get to experience joy. Our life becomes about worshiping Jesus. Worship Jesus, and there we find joy and fulfillment. There is a very famous verse in the Bible, in the last book of the Bible, where Jesus says, I will, I am standing at the door and knocking. He who lets me in will uh, experience me coming in and having dinner with that person. In the ancient Near East, to invite someone into your home for dinner, uh, to uh, go to someone's home for dinner, it's a great honor to sit and break bread and, and, and have that communion. When Jesus was here in his earthly ministry, he chose to sit with those that needed him most. The outcasts of society, tax collectors, prostitutes, sinners of every kind, sinners like you, sinners like me that need him. Maybe you need to believe. Maybe you need a relationship with him. Go to my website. The link is in the description below. And there you can begin a very wonderful and exuberant and sometimes painful adventure in this life and into the life that is here to come. God bless you. I hope to see you there. God bless you and peace be with you.